what's going on everyone? My name is Chris and welcome to Path to Wellness. This is my YouTube channel and I'm going to be putting together a smoothie today. And if you're new to my channel, I practice intermittent fasting, a plant-based diet, and I enjoy doing calisthenics workouts. So we're going to get started here. Right now it's about 1 o'clock and I did my workout at around 11 a.m. So uh, lately I've been eating uh, about a six up, five to six hour eating window. So I start around 1 p.m. And I've been finishing my meals at about 6 p.m., sometimes as late as seven. So about five to six hours. And I'm gonna be walking you through what I'm gonna be eating today. So I usually, I'd say nine out of 10 days, start off with a big smoothie. And in this smoothie, this is gonna be one of my favorites here. So I'll show you everything I'm putting in this thing. I'm gonna start off with some coconut water. Now, if this smoothie looks too big, you can always cut this recipe in half. I make my smoothies pretty big because I only eat maybe two or three meals and I'm very, very active. So I need to get enough calories in. But if you're smaller than me or you're not that active or you need to lose weight, you can certainly cut this recipe in half. Um, for this smoothie, I'm gonna put in two cups of coconut water. The best thing to do would just be to buy coconuts and cut them open, but I'm kind of lazy about that, so I usually just buy coconut water. It's just organic coconut water. There's nothing added to it, just plain coconut water. But buying it or getting the coconuts directly would be best. But um, this is just how I do it. So I got two cups of coconut water. I'm gonna put in, I love using frozen berries because the regular berries aren't always in season or always taste as good. So I just, uh, usually for my smoothies, I use frozen berries. So I'll do one cup of blue, uh, blueberries, and any kind of berries are good, so it doesn't matter. Sometimes I use mixed berries, sometimes I use um, strawberries, whatever. Uh, I do have one cup of strawberries as well. So I usually get in two cups of berries. Blueberries are probably my favorite, so I always like to use at least one cup of blueberries. But that doesn't really matter. Uh, next, I'm going to put in a little bit of cacao powder. This is a great antioxidant. I think cacao powder is a great food, but I don't need a lot of it. I don't. I try. I try not to eat a lot of it. So I'm just going to put in um, like one tablespoon. Probably not even that. Just a, just a little flavoring. Put that in there, and then I'm going to add some soap chia seeds. So the way I do this is I take a third cup of whole chia seeds and a cup and a half of water. And you just want to put those in a container and put them in the refrigerator for at least a couple hours, stir them up really well, and they'll last a few days. So I'm gonna put in um, a few tablespoons, like maybe three, four tablespoons of this. This is great for aiding in digestion. My digestion is fantastic. And I, one of the reasons why I think it is so well is because, hold on one second, of the fact that I eat a lot of soaked chia seeds. I have soaked chia seeds pretty much every day, usually in my smoothies. I'll just put the rest of this in here. Okay, the timer that just went off are these bananas. These were frozen, so I just heated them up. Let me go dump this water out, one second. be adding these bananas to the smoothie. A lot of time I'll just put uh, fresh bananas in. Sometimes I do frozen. It just depends. But before I put the bananas in, let me finish putting in the other ingredients. I have been soaking these bananas for five minutes. So the next thing that's going in is the Marcus Roscrans Green Pro C formula. So um, this is, I don't, I'm not huge into supplements. Um, I don't really take supplements, but I do take, I do have green powder. Uh, this, this one in particular is the Green Pro C. So Marcus Roscrans sells the green powder, the protein powder, and the vitamin C powder. This is all three of them in one. So these are just like plants that have been dried up. A lot of nutrition in this package here, a lot of nutrition. So I'm going to put a few tablespoons of this, maybe three, big tablespoons. 
get some extra nutrition in there. I do recommend that, by the way. I don't sell it. I don't sell anything. I just something I recommend. Uh, I'm gonna put a little peanut butter in here. So depending on, depending on your level of health, you may or may not want to use peanut butter. Um, I don't necessarily think that peanut butter is a health food, but I think it tastes good. So um, I just put a little bit in my smoothie. Some people would say peanut butter is healthy. Other people would say it's not healthy. Just depend on who you ask. All right, got some peanut butter there. And I'm gonna put in the bananas last. So once I've uh, defrosted those for five minutes, they should just slip out of here. It makes it nice and easy. And I got five bananas here. I put in maybe three tablespoons of uh, three tablespoons of peanut butter. So this smoothie is, like I said, quite big. It's quite filling. I haven't, you know, I've been fasting for about 18 and 19, about 19 hours now, actually. And I did a pretty hard workout. So um, I'm pretty hungry now. I'm ready to eat. This smoothie is going to be over a thousand calories for sure. Uh, you could tone it way down. You can make one that's like 500 calories, but if I did something like that, I'd just be hungry too soon. So no point in me making a smoothie that small after this long of a fast and my workouts and all my walks and everything else I do. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and blend this thing up. I used to have a Vitamix, but it broke, unfortunately. So now I use a Ninja. This thing was like a third of the price. It still works pretty good. It's not as good as the Vitamix. I do recommend Vitamix. I'll get one someday. But this thing works well enough. All right. There it is. So this smoothie right here, this is a pretty big one. This made a liter and a half. So I'm gonna essentially get back to work. I'm gonna get back to work. Uh, I'm gonna enjoy this smoothie. Nice liter and a half, well over a thousand calories here, I'm sure, or at least a thousand. And um, when I'm ready for my next meal, I'll be back and I'll show you what I'm eating. Cheers. All right, I'm back and now it's about 4.15. Headed down to the park to go on a walk. It's a nice sunny day. It's still a little chilly, but at least it's nice and sunny. We got Blackberry in the house here, in the car. And I'm having my second meal for today. It's a bowl of fruit. I have a bunch of tangerines, probably like five tangerines and an apple. So this will be my second meal today. Get some fresh air, get some more sunshine. And then I'm gonna be back for one more meal today. So I'll be back soon with one more thing.